I thought I'd do a sort of unboxing video for my new 3D printer. It seemed as though you wouldn't be able to go wrong if you followed the instructions, but I smacked my knuckle on the floor and I wasn't very happy about it. The packaging was so well thought through that it actually inspired me to try and do something similar with my sunglasses packaging. If and when I get round to that, I'll let you know. The machine uses these coils of plastic cord that go in this special box. I forgot to film how it goes in there, so do your best to imagine it. The machine told me that it needed calibration for half an hour, so I watched it. It just sort of moved around within the machine, finding each corner. It was hypnotic. I began to mimic its movement. It suggested I did a test print of a little toy boat. It's getting cold in the workshop. Maybe the boat could accompany me in a nice hot bubble bath later. As it's printing the boat, let me explain why I've got a 3D printer. In February, people will start to receive my wonderful new sunglasses design. If I want to make any small changes to the mechanisms, I can test them very quickly now. And we can also print bits and pieces that'll help around the workshop. My test print of that little toy boat took about 25 minutes from start to finish. It was stuck to the machine's bed, surprisingly firmly. I like it, but I regret to inform you that it's not seaworthy. And so my bubble bath is cancelled.